Hey, today I'd like to show you how to scan candlestick patterns uh, in the interactive stock charts application. Uh, this works for any um, a platform, uh, desktop or mobile, but I'll show you the desktop application first. There is a, a candlestick pattern scan tool on the toolbar. You click on this button, then uh, you select the, the, the pattern from a list. It's quite a long list and um, if you're not familiar with the candlestick patterns, you should read the tutorial on the website. Um, so, for example, I select Morning Star. This is a three candle pattern with a one down day followed by a short uh, star like doji like pattern, um, then followed by long uh, uh, up, up candle. And you want to select the the scan duration to be as long or as relevant as you want. Uh, this shows you the maximum. Uh, there are 5,800 uh, data points in this SPY data, uh, SPY chart, daily chart. Um, so I'm just gonna say 5,000, just uh, an example, so you can see as many uh, patterns as possible. And the prior trend length. Um, Usually, uh, candlestick patterns require uh, either a down downtrend uh, prior trend or or uptrend prior trend. Uh, if you're familiar with the uh, um, bullish or bearish candlestick patterns, you will know um, that's usually a requirement, and you can select uh, the length how long you how strong or how long you want the the prior trend to be by selecting this parameter usually i just leave a five uh, the more the longer you select the fewer results you'll get but uh, it is it will be completely dependent on your strategy so this this tool is highly customizable so i just go ahead and uh, scan the morning star pattern now it returns you there are only seven morning star patterns in the given uh, chart in the last 5000 trading days and when you click OK, it will highlight uh, the first one. Here, there is a down candle, and followed by the morning star, then the up candle. And to go forward and backward, you use these two uh, buttons. Normally, these two buttons will just scroll the chart one day at a time, but when there is highlighted objects like this uh, from the scanning result, it will just jump to the next uh, result. So the, there is another one, morning star, and another, and another. Here, here there are two candlestick uh, pattern, the morning star patterns uh, right next to each other. So it shows you here. Um, it is quite rare, but uh, it's also now I'm also showing the TR indicator uh, in this region, and this proves to be a good buying point. Okay, let's uh, uh, scan another pattern. Uh, you notice the scan duration decreased to three thousand. Uh, this is because you the the scanner will count the number of data points from from the current uh, viewpoint of the chart. So it will because you already scroll back at the chart in time to two thousand five. So the starting point will be here. Therefore, there are fewer data points. So you want to scan something like a uh, uh, bullish piercing line for for results, and you want if you want to go back to the to the current day, you just press the refresh button, and now you're back to the current day. And if you want to now, there are five thousand eight hundred data points again. Um, if you want to scan something more common, like uh, doji, for example, um, th they'll give you 347 dojis. And they're all highlighted uh, as a yellow uh, highlight color. But the currently selected one is blue, and you can scroll through each one, like so.